You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Here we go, guys. Rachel Richardson. That's who we're going to be talking about here in this video. And also Don Staley. Rachel Richardson lied. It was a flat out lie. Nobody called her a racial slur. She said that it happened every single time she was actually serving the volleyball. Did not happen. She's the only one that actually said this when nobody, not even anybody on her own Duke volleyball team could actually verify that somebody called her the N-word. It was a hoax. It has been proven a hoax. It has been investigated. But that brings us to uh, Don Staley. Now, Don Staley, not a volleyball coach. She's actually a basketball coach for South Carolina. She came out and actually canceled basketball games against BYU. Because to her, BYU is racist. They didn't believe Rachel Richardson and therefore games must be canceled. Now, this was before the investigation actually completed. But now we know that Rachel Richardson is nothing more than a Bubba Wallace and Juicy Smoothie. She is in that same category, folks. Don Staley has not come out and um, apologize. And guys, she made it pretty clear. She is not going to apologize until Rachel Richardson actually comes out and says that um, she apologizes. Folks, we know that will never, ever happen. When you're actually playing the race game, the race holds. To you, you are never wrong. You're never wrong. These woke people out there will never apologize for anything. So Don Staley is just backing Rachel Richardson no matter what, even though she is a liar. Over here on OutKick, Don Staley refuses to apologize for a canceling BYU game, makes absurd comments defending herself. Yeah, Don Staley looks like a complete fool here, folks. A complete fool. She can't swallow her pride and actually say, you know what? I was wrong. I shouldn't have canceled those games. Because um, Rachel Richardson, which she actually said could not be ver verified. She didn't do any of that. She is backing a liar. It says here, Don Staley thinks she did nothing wrong when she canceled a game against BYU. The South Carolina coach pulled the plug on a game against the Cougars following uh, racial slur allegations from Duke volleyball player Rachel Richardson. The Duke player cl claimed fans used racial slurs during a, during a match against the Cougars. Actually, I believe she was saying it was one person and they did um, end up kicking out a person and banning him. And then they found out, wait a minute. This didn't happen, so they unbanned a the fan. Uh, the allegations were supported by absolutely zero evidence. And in fact, all signs point to the situation apparently being a hoax. Did Staley apologize for canceling the BYU game over an event that appears to not have occurred at all? And in the process, smeared an entire program? Nope. So check out this clip right here, guys. Check this out. Don Staley looks like a complete idiot here in this clip. She was wrong. She should have not canceled the games against BYU. Rachel Richardson lied. Listen to this, guys. Did the young lady come out and say uh, that she apologized for hearing something wrong? Did she come out and say that yet? I haven't seen that. Okay, that, that's, that's her story. So that's, that's what she's sticking with. Until she comes out and says that, then I'll be the first to apologize. I'll be the first to say I'm wrong, but that has yet to come out. So that's what I'm sticking with. Wow. Don Staley is a moron. She won't apologize until Rachel Richardson comes out and apologizes. Rachel Richardson will never, ever say she made it up. She will never say that. She's playing the professional victim card. Has a juicy smoothie. Over the past, what, three years since his um, race holds, has he ever said that I made it all up? Even though his collaborators, you know, the black Africans actually came out and said, yeah, he paid us to do it. Juicy Smoothie to this day has not came out and said, yeah, I made it up. I'm sorry. I mean, he made a whole mockery of the court. The man lied. He got sentenced to jail. He's still not in jail though yet, folks. I mean, 
mind goodness. Another story I digress. Has not happened. Bubba Wallace, same thing. He has not apologized for making up the story about the noose that was proven false by the FBI. Rachel Richardson will never, ever apologize. Don Staley knows this, but Don Staley's woke. And uh, she's also um, come out and um, thrown her support behind uh, Brittany Griner. I don't know what it is about these woke athletes and woke coaches. They don't believe in the facts. They refuse to actually believe the facts. Investigations happened and nothing was found. It was completely made up. But Don Staley can't swallow her pride and just apologize. She still doesn't have to play the games against on BYU. But she should come out and, and apologize. But she's not going to do it. This is what woke losers do. That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans. Let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.